Not an exciting weekend of college hockey here in South Dakota. And um, our guys came off an emotional night last night and came out and seemed to have fed off the energy. They just continued right in the first period, three goals. Um, and then the game tilted in their favor and Zach Rose, uh, hell us in it. And, th and that was really the story of the game. He gave our guys a chance to collect themselves and come out and, ha and they had a heck of a third. They, they, they came together and talked about it and, um, and it was really everyone, uh, everyone involved this weekend, um, and and really special weekend for Zach, and and, and uh, so proud of him. Coach, he's been through a lot with the multiple surgeries with uh, Bowling Green, and now he comes over to you guys, and this was a big weekend for him, I think, too mentally, right? He he had a little extra, I don't know what energy maybe against these guys. Yeah, I mean. It, and that's a position, though, that you see guys that go through adversity. If they can come through it on the other side stronger, um, it works to their advantage. And, and we, you know, it's still early, but we've certainly liked uh, what Zach's done for us. Tremendous student, tremendous kid. Uh, as you build a foundation and a culture, he's someone you want with you. Uh, and, and just excited to keep moving forward with him. First two weekends are complete now, and I thought uh, I've seen you play at least on uh, on film until tonight. I thought you played very, very solid positionally all the way through. What, what's the secret? How can you do that so quickly? Like the players. The, the players are committed to playing a team game. Um, and, and maybe it's by nature of uh, an expansion team or what we're doing here, but uh, these guys are, they're team guys, they're committed to each other um, and, and that style of play. Uh, and, and we still got a lot of work to do, but um, we're proud of where they're at right now. What does it say about parity in college hockey that, that you can start up like this and compete immediately and get two wins and do what you need to do? Parity is as tight as it's ever been. That's yeah. why it's a great time to bring college hockey to South Dakota. Um, and, but again, we're four games in. So, um, it, you know, when you start a season, you want guys to get to enjoy moments like these and feel like the hard work they're putting in is going to lead to a result. Um, it builds trust. It builds belief. Um, and and this weekend just one step forward for us. Pretty comfortable in your temporary home? Huh. This is home, baby. Uh, and, and, and we can feel it, because those, those fans that are gonna be at Midco, they came over to the Premier Center. Uh, we fed off the energy they provided. Uh, and they were having a heck of a time. Like, you see the videos that came out. They, they, they were rocking the joint, and, and our guys, uh, that's, why you, that's why you play college hockey. Zach, I look like you know, tonight just specifically, you had the glove really working. Uh, you know, talk about sort of how comfortable you started feeling in that first period. You know, you got three goals and uh, the offense really gave you something to work with too. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, it's not hard to feel comfortable when the boys come out and score three right off the bat. Um, just trying to stay uh, even keeled with it and, and stick with it. But, I mean, when the boys play like that in front of me, there's not a lot I can play about. Coach, second period, they really seem like they, they kind of pressed you guys a little bit. Uh, walk me through sort of what you guys regrouped going into that intermission and coming out the third. We, we just got disconnected. Uh, and what that means is we just, we, we like to do everything together. And we had, you know, we just, for whatever reason, we had ice in the middle of the rink that was wide open. Um, and they were able to find it. Again, they're, they're, a, they're a competitive team that, that came out and wanted to play. They want, you know, back-to-back -back nights. Uh, they came here to get a win in a, in a split. Uh, so they leaned on us, that's sports. Uh, like I told the guys in between the second, when you're trying to get them to just relax and refocus, that's why you have a goalie. Sometimes he's got to bail you out, sometimes you got to bail him out. Um, and he did that tonight for us in a big way. How about Ulo, a big night for him? Great night for him. And we've been seeing him just take steps, just baby steps. Um, and tonight you, you had to, you got to see like some of the things he can do. Brett Mearman, uh had a wraparound goal. He was a plus three on the night. Um, you know, talked about him, you call him Wiggles? Yeah. <laughs> we don't need to get into that, but uh, he, you know, I'm most proud of the game he played. Take the goals out of it. He just played the right way uh, and he was coming off a uh, welcome to college hockey weekend as a freshman at Wisconsin, uh, where he didn't find much time and space, uh, and he just was more committed to the team game, uh, unselfish style of play he had today, and then he gets rewarded. Uh, that now you know now you think it, you're in his shoes. 
you, you gain confidence, you know. Now it makes sense why coach asks you to carry the puck and, and, to, and to put it low and, and to be committed to more of a ground game. Um, man, there's nothing better than your first college goal. So excited for him. I, I, you know, you look at the numbers and it's 44-30 in shots on goal, but defensively you guys really limited the high-end chances. I mean, talk to me about the way the defense sort of shut them down on the back end there. I think I thought we were we were committed to protecting the house, as we call it. Um, we, we had bodies back trying to protect Zach, but we we kind of let him off the hook and let him have far too much offensive zone time and moments. And, then, and we're all talking about the second period here. Um, so again, we're we're so early on. There's the exciting part is there's so much growth ahead of us, um, and and we feel like these guys are committed to it. Zach wasn't like walking through that line at the end. Uh, you couldn't wipe the smile off my face. I mean, it's, it was something special. Uh, and they all had good things to say too, which which helps. Um, there's no bad blood there, so that was awesome. Coach, I mean, you have a week off here, two weeks here. So, you, what going into practice? I mean, what is sort of the focus to keep this energy up? We're we're here. We're here to work. This program is going to be built through our hard work. We've won two hockey games. That's great news. Bad news is we've only won two hockey games in the history of this program. Um, we, we want to win more, um, and, and we know we got to work hard at it. We're going to see some darn good teams. Uh, we've got a great schedule, and, and, and we got to stay committed to each other, and, and, and the, there's no secrets in the, the sport of hockey. You get out of it what you put in. Zach, your thoughts on being an August 10 or Viking and what it's been like to look, you know, wherever month or two that you've been around here? Uh, it's been it's been special. Uh, you hear a lot from Rabs, you know, preaching the team, but uh, there hasn't been much preaching done of him. And the way that the guys rally around him and all of our coaches, it's it's something special. They make uh, going to the rink every day fun. Uh, and then you guys saw it last night with the crowd. That was that was awesome. Just the the way that the arena would erupt. Um, you definitely feel the support in the community from the school, and uh, it, it, it's been amazing. How special was it for you to get these two wins? That'll always be in the history books for Augustana <clears throat> against Bowling Green. I mean, I, I don't, I don't like the uh, how special is it for you. I want to take me out of it. You know, it's, it's the school, it's the program. Uh, we've got a long history to go, um, so you know, it's, it's all about the team. I'm happy to be part of it. Congratulations, guys. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you.